No, these aren't briefcases. These are the Dell Latitude 5420 Rugged and the Latitude 7424 Rugged Extreme. Both of these laptops were tested to military standards, so high altitudes, extreme temperatures, and water ingress are just a few of the tests they should be able to survive. Now we're going to test their durability by dropping them from various heights and then exposing them to water. So without further ado, let's see how these beasts hold up. The Dell Latitude 5420 Rugged from 3 feet. The six foot drop of the Dell Latitude 7424 Rugged Extreme. All the latches stayed on, nothing fell off. Looks like it survived. Both of these laptops fared really well in our drop tests. There was really a minimal physical evidence of the drops, just a few scuffing on the sides and one of the ports popped open. Both of the laptops booted up quickly and didn't have any issues operating the touchpad or the touchscreen. So overall, they did a really great job. Now both of these laptops should be able to withstand exposure to water from any angle. So we're gonna start with the Latitude 5420. I'm gonna put it under the sink, turn on the water, and make sure it gets into all of these little nooks and crannies. Then we're gonna go to the Latitude 7424 Rugged Extreme and see how that one does. I think I gave it a good bath there. Uh, we're gonna put them to the side, dry them off, and see if they turn back on. So far, so good. Wow. Impressive. Just like the 7424, the light turned green. The Dell logo is, is displayed. And look at that, we've got Windows. Touchpad, no issues with it. Very smooth, very responsive. Let's test the keyboard. The screen is working perfectly. Both of these rugged laptops passed our water test and our drop test. For more coverage of the Dell Latitude 5420 Rugged and the Latitude 7424 Rugged Extreme, stay tuned to Laptop Mag for my full review. This has been Philip Tracy.